On a mission to study the blue sky which appears in the sky during the night, a spaceman spent six months alone in the space. He was about to die of loneliness because his wife refused to communicate with him when some mysterious creature appeared in his spaceship. Before, Before we, continue, we continue, please, please like, like this, this video. video. Subscribe, Subscribe and hit, hit the, the notification, notification bell for more, more videos, videos like, like this. this. Thank, Thank you. you. In the beginning of the movie, a man named Jackson can be seen in a spaceship deep in space. He has been in the space alone for the past six months. He was sent there by his country's government to study the purple sky that started appearing in the sky for the past years. Before Jackson embarked on the journey he had a serious argument with his wife Lanka. Lanka was not in support of him leaving her and going to the space. Jackson has gone to the space many times which she wasn't happy about but she still choose to support him. Lanka was pregnant on one of the times he traveled to the space. She was sad and lonely and even had a miscarriage at that time. This time she was pregnant again and Jackson want to travel. She begged Jackson not to travel but Jackson who was hell-bent on making a name for himself refused and told her that he has to go. Jackson's father was also a spaceman and he was killed when Peter was small. Jackson's father was a maniac when it comes to studying the space and making new discoveries. Jackson's father did many bad things which Peter saw as doing bad for a good reason, but his father was arrested and killed. Jackson was also thrown into a river to drown but he was saved by someone. Since then, he has developed a phobia for water. As Jackson grew up, he was determined to make a name for himself and clean the shame of what happened when he was small. Hence upon all the persuasion from his wife he still insisted and traveled out of the space to study the purple cloud. It has been six months since Jackson left Earth and his wife has refused to talk with him with a communication device he used to communicate with people on Earth. Jackson has spoken to his co-workers on Earth who monitors his spaceship to know when he is in danger. Jackson has told them many times to give his wife the communication device so that he can talk to her but they told him that they have tried but his wife has refused to speak with him. Jackson was depressed when he could not speak with his wife, he started overthinking. He didn't know how but his moments with his wife when he was on earth keep playing in his mind. Jackson tried to stop it but couldn't stop. And the more the memory keep playing the more he misses his wife. One day, as he was communicating with the people monitoring his spaceship on earth he heard a voice. The voice seemed to be talking to him but he didn't get what the voice said. At first, he thought that it was the voice of the person at the other end of the phone but he soon realized that the voice is not sounding like a human voice. And the voice is not sounding from the communication device but inside the spaceship. Jackson walked around the spaceship trying to find the source of the voice but couldn't, so he thought that he is stressed out and that is why he is hearing voices and that it is also the reason his memory with his wife keeps playing in his mind. Jackson continued living his normal live in the space as he waited for the ship to reach the purple cloud so that he can study. But one day Jackson opened one of the rooms in the ship and saw a being that shocked him. It was a black giant spider that can talk. Jackson was shocked that he started stepping back. The giant spider told Jackson not to fear and that he is not going to harm him, but Jackson didn't listen to it. Jackson keeps stepping back. He ran out of the room and closed it locking the giant spider inside. He was scared and stayed for some time before he went back and opened the door again. The giant spider came closer to Jackson again and told him that it will not harm him, but Jackson didn't listen to it. He ran into the safe room in the ship and locked it. After locking it and wore his space suit and then pressed a button to release a disinfectant gas in, in the ship, the disinfectant was released and everywhere in the ship was filled with the gas. People on Earth monitoring Jackson was confused by Jackson's action and asked him what is wrong with him and why he is releasing the disinfectant. Jackson lied to them that he just want to make sure the air is clean. After some minutes Jackson pressed a button and the disinfectant was withdrawn back into where it was stored before. After it was taken back, Jackson, still wearing his space suit came out to know if the giant spider is still alive. As he came out, he heard the giant spider's voice telling him to not fear, he looked up and saw the giant spider up in the roof of the ship. The giant spider told him that it has been here monitoring him for a long time and that it has seen that he is dying of loneliness and that he wants to help him. Jackson was still afraid, he was questioning himself whether he is hallucinating because of loneliness or if what was in front of him is real. The giant spider told him that it sensed fear in him and that he should not be afraid that it will not harm him. Jackson walked away from the giant spider and went into his bedroom. 
He lay down, fear still lingering in his heart until he slept off. When he woke up again and came out again he still saw the giant spider again. Then he knew that he was not hallucinating because of loneliness and what is in front of him is real. Jackson still didn't want to talk to the giant spider but the giant spider keeps trying to get close to him. Jackson went to where foods are stored and brought out a snack. As he was eating the snacks, the giant spider came and asked Jackson if he has anything like egg. And that it is very hungry and egg is his food. Jackson told the giant spider that he don't have any egg. He brought out one of his snacks and gave it to the giant spider and told it to try it. The giant spider collected the snack and started eating it. As it ate it, the giant spider complimented it and said that it tastes like one of the best egg it has eaten back at home. Jackson asked it where its home is. And the giant spider replied that its home is far away from the solar system, and that Gromt attacked his planet and killed all the living being on it, and that it escaped narrowly and fled through past galaxies and black holes until it reached Earth and that is how it met him. The giant spider asked Jackson why he left his wife and came to the space even though his wife begged him to not go and why he has started missing his wife after his wife refused to talk to him again. Jackson was surprised how the giant spider knew about him and his wife, but he later learned that the giant spider is the one that has been making his memory with his wife to be playing in his mind and that the giant spider also sees the memory as it plays in his mind. The giant spider told him that humans are complicated, he asked Jackson why he didn't value his wife when she was still with him but started valuing her after she has left him. That giant spider told Jackson that it will help him in his loneliness and that is why it is making his past memory with his wife play again in his mind. Sometimes later, the giant spider was at the ship's window looking at the purple cloud. Jackson came to it and asked it whether it is interested in the purple cloud as well and the giant spider answered that the purple cloud is the beginning of the universe and that the universe originated from the purple cloud. Jackson was surprised and asked the giant spider how it knew much about the purple cloud and the giant spider answered that it has also been studying the purple cloud for a long time. Both Jackson and the giant spider spent spent time together as they waited patiently for the ship to reach the purple cloud. One day as the giant spider was making Jackson's memory to play I'm his mind and also watching the memory. It saw when Jackson was making promise to his wife that he will never leave her. After playing the memory it realized that Jackson is a selfish man and that all the promise made to his wife were all lies. And that all the while Jackson was with his wife he only cared about himself and his ambition without thinking about his wife feeling. The giant spider told Jackson that he is selfish and that all he cared is only about himself. It told Jackson that since it started investigating humans that he thought that it is human nature to be selfish and self-centered, but now through Jackson's wife he realized that not all humans are selfish and that the selfish one choose to be selfish by themselves. After saying that it left. Jackson ran after it begging it to not leave, but the giant spider has already left. Jackson was sad after the giant spider left and became depressed again. He contacted the people on earth that monitors his ship and told them that he wants to speak with his wife no matter what, when they saw that there is no other way that agreed to beg his wife to speak with him. One of the man went to Jackson's wife and told her that Jackson has not been in a good mental state ever since she refused to speak with him. He begged her to speak with Jackson if not Jackson might not even return alive considering how depressed he is and the loneliness he is enduring alone in the space. After listening to him Jackson's wife agreed to speak with him. When the communication device was connected Jackson told his wife that it is now that he realized that he made a big mistake, and that he shouldn't have left her. And that he has been very selfish and never cared about how she feels and what she wants. He told her that as he has the chance again that he will not do the same mistake. After speaking he ended the call. His wife was moved after hearing him and started crying. Back in the space, Jack was relieved after speaking to his wife. He heard noise in the ship and moved to where the noise was coming from. When he reached there he saw the giant spider. Jackson was very happy to see the giant spider again. But he found out that the giant spider is seriously sick and that it will die very soon. Jackson asked the giant spider what is wrong with him and it replied that he was affected when the Gromt attacked his planet. And it is just a matter of time before it die. It told Jackson that it wants to show him something. Jackson wore his space suit and followed the giant spider outside. The giant spider led him to the purple cloud and told him that the purple space is the origin of the universe and that it contains the present, the past and the future. 
Inside the purple cloud, Jackson saw his past with his wife and also his future where he was with his wife and their new child. After showing Jack the secret of the purple cloud, the giant spider told him goodbye and died. Just then another spaceship from Korea arrived. Jack joined the spaceship and they went back to Earth. The End Don't forget to like this video, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this. Thank you.